Ontario, Canada, June 14, 2024. Oh, here comes the hail. And the car is hailing. Oh my god, that's uprooted completely out of the ground. Yeah. Holy crud, I'm worried about our trees. Severe thunderstorms moved through southwestern Ontario on Friday, June 14th, bringing heavy rain, hail, and the threat of tornadoes. The nation's capital Ottawa and much of Ontario were blanketed with warnings from Environment Canada. Environment Canada issued thunderstorm and tornado warnings for parts of Ontario and Quebec. On Friday, a spokesperson from Environment Canada said a storm producing 100 km per hour, winds moved down from Wyerton to the Owen Sound and South Georgian Bay areas. The spokesperson said it appeared that isolated pockets of severe storm activity and high winds caused downed trees and power lines throughout the province Thursday evening. Some people took to social media to document the storm as it passed over Ontario late Thursday evening into Friday afternoon. Tens of thousands of people were left in the dark in Quebec and Ontario as severe thunderstorms rocked the region Thursday night and Friday morning. At times, some areas were the subject of tornado warnings. Severe thunderstorm and tornado notices came fast and variable throughout the day, with reported risk of 100 km per hour gusts and hail from the size of tunis to ping pong balls. As of Friday morning over 45,000 people were still without power across Ontario due to the storms. The largest swath of outages affected residents around Aurelia and Huntsville. An estimated 12,000 residents were similar affected in Quebec. While communities throughout the province are impacted by small outages, Hydro One says the major outages are in the Bracebridge, Minden and Huntsville areas. Hydro One crews are out in full force, and they're responding as quickly and safely as possible to get power back on for our customers across the province. Environment Canada reports that winds were up to 100 km per hour in some places, but there were no confirmed touchdowns of tornadoes in Ontario. Totally Teixeira said because of advanced the warning, thing. they readied their crews the night the before for the anticipated right cleanup. She said crews Friday are dealing with a mix of issues from fallen branches on lines to fallen trees leading to damaged hydro poles. It's scary. The thunderstorm risk will continue across Here's parts of Quebec on Friday as the storm system pushes towards the Maritimes. Comes. A cold front moving eastwards clashed with hot and humid air in the atmosphere, 
creating copious amounts of thunderstorm energy. Tornado warnings were issued mid-afternoon in northern Ontario and many more were prompted across southern Ontario and Quebec as the storms moved through.